Well, the Chiefs certainly won some fans over when they went with a Wildcat in the first round of the 2023 NFL Draft. Made a lot of folks at home very happy, but an offseason injury kept Felix Ayudike Uzama off the field and held him back some during camp. 27 Sports reporter Landon Reinhardt gives us an update from St. Joe. It's a story you couldn't write any better yourself. K-State defensive end Felix Ayudike Uzama drafted to his hometown Chiefs in the first round of the draft the city was hosting. But it's important to remember that in every hero story, the hero must go through some hardships. And while King Felix isn't necessarily struggling, he hasn't been the dominant self that he was at K-State. With time missed from OTAs with an injury, he hasn't been able to go full throttle with the other rookies. While that may be disheartening to him and the fans, defensive coordinator Steve Spagnola says that it's growing pains that all rookies must go through. Uh, I think Felix is climbing. I really do. I mean, look, at we all know he didn't get a lot of, you know, didn't do anything in the off season here and that set him back. I thought he was a little rusty and struggled early. But Joe and I both, as you, you watch one-on-ones, you watch the team periods, he's flashing now. There's still a, a curve there, right? The learning curve. I'm learning every day. Um, I'm learning exactly what um, the coaches have for me to store, just learning technique-wise. So, um, and I thank him for saying that at the end of the day that I'm still learning, I'm still having, I'm, for me, I'm still not there yet. And, um, I got some um, learning to do. The vibe that we got from Andrew Dike Ozama's press conference today was he knows that he can be doing better, he's working at getting better, and if his transformation at K-State is any proof, he will be better. Working for you from Chiefs Training Camp in St. Joseph, Missouri, Leonard Reinhardt, 27 Sports.